Here we present the top 5 best audio interface. Starting of our listed number 5, Apple G Ensemble Thunderbolt 2. When it comes to professional audio gear, you're basically looking for a couple of things. Great audio and build quality, reliability, and a constant and pleasant workflow. Let's see how exactly the ensemble from Apogee ticks all of those boxes. As with most Apple-centered devices, do have in mind that the price is going to be pretty high. For a few grand, you're definitely getting a high-quality device. The interface feels very well built, it's sturdy and all of the buttons and knobs feel premium and precise. The front of the ensemble hosts two direct instrument inputs, with their own dedicated outputs below them. This means you can easily route the signal through the interface, while simultaneously sending it through the outputs to an amp. Selecting the actual input is done via two rows of buttons on the right of the two inputs, with handy OLED visualizers for both the input and output level. The levels are adjusted on the fly with two large knobs. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Coming in at number 4 of our list. Focusrite Scarlett 18i20. We've seen that the good folks at Focusrite know how to cater the needs of a beginner audio engineer with a tight budget. The Scarlett 18i20, with its numerous inputs and outputs, and overall amazing performance, focuses on more advanced studio needs. As it's pretty clear when you look at the picture, this model is what is called a rack interface. Though it's pretty short, the width makes it kind of impractical for desk use, so consider getting an actual rack to mount it on. The front panel, while pretty long, is extensive, yet simple enough so you don't get lost in the buttons and knobs. Only two of the eight combined analog inputs are on the front, while the rest are tucked away in the back. The controls cover level for all of the analog channels, with separate 48V boost for either the first or last four channels, when they are used with condenser microphones. Halfway of our listed number 3. Presonus Studio 192-26X32 After reading about Focusrite Scarlett 18i20, you'd think that there's hardly a better option than it, at least in that or the neighboring price range. However, the Studio 192 by Presonus offers a slightly different approach which will definitely appeal to at least a portion of the reading audience. The front panel while a bit more simple, definitely still gives you full control over the many inputs and outputs this device can handle. As expected, there are two easy-to-reach combined inputs on the left, followed by a small screen which gives you more info about the currently selected channel or preset. Going further to the right side, there is an array of LEDs that show you the exact level of each individual channel, and whether they're clipping or not. A big yet very precise dial is used for setting the main level, and the smaller two knobs are used for adjusting the individual headphone levels for each of the two outputs. Number 2 of this list. Behringer Euphoria UMC 202 HD. The Euphoria by Behringer is a great alternative to the previously mentioned Focusrite Scarlet 2i2. For half the price, you'll be getting that well-known Behringer quality, both in terms of build and the actual audio. While the price difference is relatively big, I will still try to compare it to the Scarlet 2i2, as there are not many other audio interfaces this cheap are worth mentioning and comparing to. This device is slightly smaller than the Scarlet, making it a perfect choice for anyone with an already crammed desk. You can even take the Euphoria with you when you travel, as it's completely powered through the USB connection, and is very well built. The front interface offers a similar experience to the one you'd get with the Scarlet 2i2. Two combined TRS XLR inputs on the left alongside separate line instrument and pad toggle buttons, as well as gain controls. And coming in at number one of our list, Focusrite Scarlet 2i2. Focusrite is a brand that is well known for their high-quality studio equipment, with models ranging from entry-level to professional. Their Scarlet 2i2 audio interface offers an easy and straightforward approach to recording audio for everyone looking to make their own home studio. Being on a relatively tight budget doesn't mean you have to sacrifice quality and productivity, and the Scarlet 2i2 clearly shows that with its specs and features. Starting with the compact form factor and small footprint, you can fit the Scarlet pretty much anywhere. Although it's small, it definitely can pack quite a punch. The front panel hosts two combined TRS XLR inputs, which is more than enough for recording two instruments, or a vocal and an instrument simultaneously. 
Each of the inputs has a separate switch for toggling between MIC instrument mode, as well as a gain knob for on-the-fly adjustments. You'll be getting a pretty solid audio interface. It sounds great, feels solid and durable, and most importantly, it's very easy and straightforward to use. Whether you're an aspiring audio engineer, a musician who wants to record songs, or even a more advanced studio tech that needs a small device that's travel ready, definitely check the Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 out. For more information and price, check out the product links in description, underneath the video. Thank you for watching, please subscribe our channel, share this video and hit the like button.